It was the celebration of a baseball life. Rhode Island College Hall of Famer Art Ponarelli honored by his alma mater by having the Anchorman Field renamed. Art came to me when I was a uh, senior in high school at Woonsocket, and he, uh, you know, he, he led me along the way and brought me here to Rick, where, you know, school wasn't always the best thing for me, but he kind of convinced me to, you know, stay with school, and, you know, he really, under his tutelage and coaching, you know, he really helped me further my career. In his coaching career at Rick and CCRI, the Pawtucket native helped both schools to their respective World Series while teaching and working as an administrator at Ponagansett High School. I really believe that as a, as a coach, you better teach. If you're not teaching in a lot of different ways, you're teaching the fundamentals of the game, you're teaching them, the players how to act, you're teaching, you're teaching everyone how to progress from wherever they are today to become better down the road. And so I think that if you're not a teacher, if you consider just yourself a coach, then you, you know you're missing the boat. Coach Ponarelli transitioned into professional scouting in 1992, joining the Colorado Rockies organization. He still remains in the game, working as a scout for the New York Mets, a lifelong journey through America's favorite pastime. Art's right, done a great job for us in uh, uh, both pro scouting and amateur scouting. Uh, this year he got another big leaguer, uh, Kevin McGowan. So uh, since he's been with us, he's had three big leaguers for the Mets. He's contributed greatly. Art's uh, a great guy. He hasn't forgotten where he's from. You know, he's a, he's a true blue New Englander and really a true blue Rhode Islander. And uh, I think the state has been uh, is a better baseball state because he's been a part of it. With your Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses, hometown sports hero, I'm J.P. Smallins.